Hey guys, and welcome back to Do It On A Dime with Catherine. I have heard your cries. You want to see a closet organization makeover on a budget. my friend Holly from Baby Gizmo when I organized a part of her kitchen. Well, she asked me to come back to help tackle her daughter Savannah's closet. I thought this would be a perfect space because it's kind of an awkward shape. She's storing a lot of stuff in here and kids grow so stinking fast. It is hard to keep up with stuff. Plus, I've never gotten to do a girls or teen closet, so I was really excited to tackle this project. You want to walk us through your closet? Show me how you use this every morning. Okay. I also use it for uniforms, which are all right here, and some over there, and down there, and everywhere. Okay, yeah. And you got some summer clothes, which I don't use right now, so it's kind of just here and down on the floor. You also have some toys, which I don't even touch anymore. We've got tons of stuff up here. It's very disorganized. So the first thing we did was take everything out of the closet, and I mean everything. Oh, look, I found my Packer socks. Then we made yay and nay decisions of all of the clothes working as quickly as possible. Nay. I love this dress. That's super Does cute. It fit me? Here's my brother's belt. I just wore it. <laughs> oh, I did. Maybe I did. Yay. All my uniforms fit besides all my pants. I grew. Those will fit. Yeah, they're supposed to be short. Oh, oh, makes sense. Yay. January and spring are great times to tackle a closet on a budget, and I recommend getting uniform hangers. I love the non-slip velvety kind, and you can find a large box of 35 from Costco for less than $8. That is a screaming deal, and we only needed two boxes. We designated a section of the closet for her school uniforms, which she wears every day, and a section for her weekend clothes. They're organized by color and type, so they're really easy to find. Holly picked up a cube shell from Target, and it was just 28 bucks. I think it makes the space feel like a boutique, and it was the perfect place to keep her extra pants and her shoes. We got super inexpensive canvas bins from Target, and this was the perfect place to keep some toys that are special to her that she does enjoy to play with. And now the shelves are really easy to access and nice, clean, and organized. And all the stuff she's not using can be a blessing to someone else. We found an old shelf she was gonna donate and ended up hanging it on the wall. It's the perfect place to hang all of her bows which she wears every single day. And we didn't forget a space at the bottom of the closet for all of her stuffed animals. And just by clearing all of that stuff out, it's so easy to see all of her clothes and she even had a whole section for all of the parody outfits that she uses for her videos. Make your space work for you. fun, especially Savannah's reaction. Yes. Yep, open guys. It's so organized. Do you like it? Yes, I do. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh my God. Thank you so much. You're welcome, Savannah. Organized. You are literally the most excited person I have ever organized for, and I love it. Thank that you so much. So fun. You're so <laughs> welcome. I love it. That was awesome. I love it more. <laughs>
inspire you to declutter and tackle a space in your house. And if it did, please leave it a thumbs up, leave a comment down below, check out Holly's behind the scenes video and channel. And if you have not subscribed to Do It On A Dime, what are you waiting for? Click that button, hit those notifications on, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye. So we've got our giant donation pile of everything ready to go. And most of this stuff leaves. And definitely this one. Those are my shoes. Really? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs>